<laughs> All right, let's get over to Brian Goddard. Uh, we're seeing uh, puffs of white stuff on the radar right now, Brian. Yeah, this is not a satellite image. This is radar, and that means it is picking up snow. April 19th and snow. It's, it's has snowed in May. It's just not fun to talk about. One minute it is sunny, then it is cloudy with snow, some sleet, some rain, and very strong winds. Mike from Cudahy emails me, and he just said, Uncle, I agree. Not nice. You're going to continue with these off and on throughout the evening hours. Probably start tapering off to flurry sometime after around 10 o'clock, and then we'll see some sunshine tomorrow. Accumulation would be a quick dusting, but then it's going to melt with temps near 40. We have the rain snow mix right now, and then for tomorrow, some sunshine. Oh, I should say a lot of sunshine as high pressure moves in. These gusty winds will die down to just 5 to 10 out of the southeast. Still cool here tomorrow with highs only in the 40s, but warming up back off to the west. That will be here for Sunday with highs back to normal in the 50s, but then look for sunshine to give way to clouds and then maybe when a few rain showers late in the afternoon and especially overnight Sunday. It is cold pretty much everywhere except for right along the eastern seaboard. They're got, they don't have the cold front just yet, but all the way down into Texas, they are seeing temperatures in the 50s where they should be in the mid 70s. 1145 today. This is just one of a few of these little snow squalls that came through. Lasts for a couple of minutes. Visibility goes way down. Maybe a dusting of accumulation and then it quickly melts when the sun comes out right behind it. This is what it looks like in Waukesha right now. Cloudy conditions, uh, windy as well, only 37 degrees. We should be about 55 this time of the year. We're 40 in Milwaukee, 42 in Racine, 35 in Fond du Lac, and back off to the west. Temperatures struggling to get out of the 30s. The winds continue to be 25 to 40 miles per hour out of the west. That is putting wind chills into the 20s. Lows tonight will be in the 20s. We'll have these flurries up until around midnight. Then we'll gradually clear out. You'll wake up to sunshine. Wind chills, though, could be close to 20 degrees. By tomorrow afternoon, still about 10 degrees below normal. The sun's going to feel good. The winds will be light. That's going to make it feel good. But overall, pretty chilly day outside. Then for Sunday, high pressure moves off to the east. We'll get more of a southerly wind. We'll get back into the 50s with the warm front helping. But that's also going to bring clouds. An isolated shower late afternoon. And the best chance of rain is Saturday night or Sunday night into Monday, I should say, with some maybe a half inch of rain. Highs tomorrow, 30s and 40s around the state. Grab your sunglasses. At least the sun will be out, but then that storm system rolls in here for early next week. But at least the temperatures will be warmer. Evening showers, snow showers that is, and then gradual clearing, a low of 28. 45 tomorrow, the sun's out, the winds are lighter, but it's still chilly. Here's your seven-day forecast. Sunday, 54 with a chance of rain late in the day. Better chance of rain on Monday, especially in the morning, a high near 60. And then we stay in the 50s all of next week with just a few pop-up showers. So. Minor improvement. <laughs> Progress. Yes, that's Something. a better word. <laughs>